From the dashboard screen, you'll notice now a new section on the right-hand side called Videos. Within the section, you can click on any of the videos and they'll pop up directly in the screen where you can watch them. You will notice a slight reconfiguration of the menu system. For example, to get to the custom task reports, you'd always had to come to the home area before going to custom task reports. You can now access the same menu throughout the application. Simply go to tasks, custom task reports, and it will navigate you directly to the home area to the right page. It is now possible for a user other than the administrator to add clients to the account. Simply go to more clients and add a client. This must be set however as a user right. To add the user to be able to manage clients, go to administration, users, and in this example we'll give George here the right to manage clients and simply click update. You will now notice that throughout the application, time is added through a pop-up. So for example, at this project level, we go to time, add time, and a pop-up shows up rather than loading another page. Simply add your time to the selected task and save and the pop-up dismisses. Prior to now, expenses that were assigned to a project cannot be changed to another project. This has been added. You can now go to Expenses, My Expenses, open an existing expense, and now change it to another project and task. The recent enhancements to the Task Document section has been ported to the Project Documents section. In any project, go to Documents, Project Documents, and you'll notice the same functionality and look and feel at the Task Documents section. So for example, to edit the document is a pop-up, to lock a document, and to preview. The document tree has also been shifted. It used to be in the top corner and has now been added to the bottom left. You will now notice from the New Project page that when you want to create a new project from a template, there's a new option called Copy Task Recurrences. You can now select Copy Task Recurrences and the task recurrences that exist that are ported to the new project can be activated on a date by selecting in a date or not activated at all, where in this manner you'd have to go in and manually activate the recurrences. In general, you should experience enhanced speed and performance throughout the application. For example, just simply opening a large list should now be quicker, and all drop-down menus have been enhanced as well.